Hi, Lewis Cahill from Ginkin Gasoline at the Sims booth at IFTD 2015. With my good buddy Rich Hahn. Rich, good to see you. Always a pleasure, buddy. Six IFTD awards last night, two iCast awards, a total of eight for Sims. Yeah, it's a record for us, Lewis. Uh, our product team came with some awesome product, and uh, we were able to get the word out and get some people over here to see it, and uh, very fortunate to have come home with some really cool awards. Strong showing, yeah. man. And these boots are in the winners, right? They are. This is brand new for spring 16 out in November. It's called the Intruder Boot, Lewis. This is a first of a kind for us. Um, made for wet wading wading boot, right? So generally nice. when you have your favorite boot and you're not in your wader, you have a little too much extra room, even if you're wearing a guard sock or neoprene sock, it just kind of can't get that right fit when you're out there wet wading. So this thing is a narrower last, um, and obviously the most visual um, difference in this, it has the integrated neoprene sock wow. right in it, right? Yeah, and so awesome. this thing is just sewn right in there. We've tested this throughout the world. Um, to stands up to the test of some pretty demanding anglers and uh, really, really innovative. You can wear this thing just barefoot and that's really what it's designed for. Right, you yeah. can put another small sock in there if you'd like, um, if it fits well, but we designed this. So if you want to just put your foot in there and ready to go, the rest of it's neoprene line, like a lot of our boots at Sim. So super comfy, got some TPU plating on the outside because we know you're going to beat this boot up yeah. against rocks and things like that. Um, Mega Grip Sole from Vibram, which is the same one that we have on our Vapor boot currently right now. And then um, this one's really cool, this innovative felt patterning here. So you've got, um, you've got the Vibram on the outside, the felt down the middle that you can also cleat up. You can cleat up this version as well. Um, and then this is really nice. So when you're on snow or grass or something where felt can kind of slip a lot, you know, right. we've yep. all done that. Um, and you need a little bit extra bite on the edge, this has got it for you. So this is really cool. We're really good proud hard of it. edges are gonna work climbing over rocks exactly. and digging into banks and stuff. And it's gonna make this sole last longer too. Absolutely it will. Yeah, yeah. I really, yeah. I really and like it. And a lot less uh, felt, you know, it seems we're really, um, really want people to inspect clean and dry their gear, especially the, those yep. felt soles, right? So if the yep. less felt we can use, well, I think we're a little bit better off for the for the ecosystem. This thing really feels like a hiking boot. It does. It's lightweight, mm -hmm. the shank is really nice and stiff, it's got good support, really slim profile, I and mean, it just looks like it's gonna be a pleasure to wade in. And this neoprene gasket here is yes. a brilliant idea. Yes. I stuck yes. my hand in here, and it even sealed up good around yeah. my wrist, so yeah. that's gonna keep anything from does a really good job of keeping debris out there, Lewis, and, and it's like you said, that gasket it's uh, going to be super effective, and uh, we're really, really excited about this. Movie. Really sweet, man. Yep. Yep. Sims is killing it right now. I love it. Thanks for taking the time to chat with us. Always a pleasure, buddy. If you're a wet waiter, heat of summer, get out and check out a pair of these. They look like they're going to rock. Stay tuned to G&G &G for more from IFTD 2015.